Hi YouTube, it's your girl Miani here and as you can see my dreads are out again. Yes they are. They're still here. You guys, I didn't get rid of them. I took my, I stopped wearing my wig cap like um, I don't know, like a few days ago. I think like Thursday or Wednesday or something like that, I, last Wednesday I started wearing my hair out again. And I twisted it. I use I still use the Eco Styler. You guys can probably just wait. Ah, you guys can see it right back. <laughs> I'm so silly. Right back there. Green bottle right there. Um, I'm still using that, and everything is you know still the same. I'll show you guys some still pics at the end. Oh, ooh, I got see this. What in the world? What is this floss? Oh, I got thread all up in my damn hair. But I still have my purple ends, which look blue sometimes, but they're purple. And it's going very, very nicely. I wish they were fuller, but they're not. So you got to deal with what you have. Uh, how long is it now? It's been almost two and a half years, I want to say. I had locks. Damn, that seemed long. And this one right here is the longest and it gets on my nerves sometimes, as I've been saying in all my videos. So I'll let you guys see what the back look like. The dreads, they're back. But let me tell you guys some other stuff. I finally, not finally, but I got the job. Remember the job that I told you guys I interviewed for um, a while ago. So I am currently on the staff of New York and Company. I do not work with Ulta anymore. Um, it's been about maybe two, no, it's been about a month now since I was offered the position. The interview went really well, like I said. It went really well. Um, they called me back with an offer. I accepted, I gave my two weeks at Ulta. And um, last Friday was actually my last day working at Ulta and the New York company that was um, close to the Ulta I was, I was working at because I was training at that location. So today I start at an Ulta that's, I mean, Ulta, a New York company that's closer to my house. I'm so excited. I don't have to like take that long 45 minute drive anymore. I'm like 25 minutes away from my house. So I'm very, very excited. And let me tell you guys, this book, The Secret, it works. Like everything, not everything, but like, Two out of the four things that I have on my, um, what's it called? Visionary board came to pass. Like, I'm telling you, when I, when they first called me about this job, what I did was, um, I, I turned around and I saved the number in my phone. But what I did was I saved it under new job. So like for me, that was just saying, okay, I already have this job. It's going to come to me. The interview is going to go well. And it did. Like, you have to put things into action for yourself. You have to have that that faith and that strength of knowing that whatever you think of is going to come to pass if you have just the faith behind it. And that's what I did. Like, I said, new job. So every time they called me about, you know, coming in for an interview or anything like that, it just kept popping up in my phone as new job, new job, new job. And it is my new job. So I'm here to tell you guys that that book really does help you to, like, train your mind and get started on the path that you want to go on but you have to be a believer you have to want to make a good change in your life so whatever you're trying to do hold on to it and really really like don't let anything get in the way like negative stuff people trying to veer you in a different direction just stay focused and do what you have to do like for that whole month or two months that I was trying to change what I was doing I shut everything down like I wasn't talking to people, my friends, uh, Facebook, all this. I was still on Facebook, but I wasn't as close-knit with my friends as I should have been. And I, hopefully I didn't lose a lot of friends in the process. And if I did, then you're really not my friend to begin with. Begin with because something that small can tear us apart, then pff, I don't want to see you around for the big stuff then. Because I need somebody that's going to be there, my backbone. I don't need a whole entourage of friends. Give me one or two, five good people that I can roll with and we good to go. But um, like I said, I just shut everything around me down. I wasn't 
chit-chatting on the phone. I was just like focused on what I needed to do and got a new job. And I got a new boo. We're not going to talk about him right now, but everything's going really, really, really well. Like everything I put on my board as far as what I want in another person, like this guy really does have all these qualities and they're genuine. It's not fake stuff. But I'm just all over the place with this video. Let me tell you guys, remember in my last video, I was about to go get my tattoo, um, <laughs> my tattoo touched up because it faded so badly. Now, I was so pissed when I left this place again. This man, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it says the secret. This man wrote on my hand in any type of way that he wanted to. He did not give me the same script that I had before. He just wrote the secret on my hand before I had it was in script like the letters were touching each other now he just gave me some it looked like freaking comic sans you see like this look at I'm not even gonna go into it it is what it is I can't take it off but I'm still I'm still happy to have it here because I know what it means for me and actually it stands out a little bit more he used a thicker needle this time which he should have done the first time and he went deeper Woo! he went deeper and this one is still, I'm trying to get, uh, yeah, this one is still cool. So I have those on my homes. What's up? Those are my tattoos. But you guys, I am going to head out. I'm still, look, now, look, now that I have this job, it's going to be better because it's kind of like my my schedule is going to be far ahead it's going to be planned for the whole month so i know what days i'm off i know when i'm getting home early when i gotta go in late so everything is going to be planned you guys you guys are gonna, probably going to see more videos you're probably going to get more of your questions answered you're probably going to see that freaking tutorial that i've been trying to work on and i'm still thinking about the whole doing it live um on block tv or something like that doing the whole session live i'll probably get somebody to do the hair on because I don't think I'm going to be putting that thing back on and I got to do a review on that goddamn hair that I had on I'm gonna tell you all about that probably later tonight when I come home or maybe tomorrow or Wednesday but we gonna talk about this hair here right there because it's a whole nother ball game I don't know what they did but remember that girl that I told y'all on that pack of hair that I didn't know hold on this story Anyhow, I hope you guys were able to keep up with me in this video. I just tried to get everything in there that I couldn't remember. Oh, my puppy. But I am going to get out of here, go to work. That's how I end a lot of my videos, don't I? I'm going to get up out of here. Yeah, I am. I'm going to go get some damn brake fluid for my car so I can pump them brakes. Because it's about to be springtime and, you know, everybody be driving like a damn fool and you need good brakes. So you don't freaking kill people. Anyhow, people, until next time, Miss Miani, keep rising. Peace.